Hey, what's up, guys? Anybody out there that's uh, that's receiving this error, the smart hard disk error, um, hard disk error, hard disk one error 301. Basically, that means it's time to replace your hard drive. It means your your disk drive is it's dying. It's getting ready to die. Um, if you see this. There is a workaround, but it won't won't last you for long. So, if you if you're at this stage, what I suggest you do is, um, what you can do right now is if you if you hit the Control Alt Delete, it will. Let me see if I can just press Escape. Yes, I uh, I can. All right, so I'm just gonna turn it off. But if you hit Control Alt Delete. It would take you to the uh, I don't remember I don't remember what settings it is, but I'll show you where where to go. And this is for the HP HP laptops. Uh, I'm not sure if it's the same thing for Dell or or any other brand lap laptops. I'm not sure if you get the same error. But um, if you see this, that means there is hope and there is a way you can get your files back but like I said if you see this thing it will not last for long eventually it will die and then you know your computer won't be able to boot into the windows or whatever but anyway let me show you what to do to work around for this by the way safe mode won't work or um, or, or yeah safe mode is not gonna work I tried it already and I just I, I can't get into it but anyway I'm gonna shut the laptop down right now as you can see I'm shutting it down all right just turn it back on and you're gonna press the escape key just keep pressing the escape key now it's gonna show this again just keep pressing it until it gets to the like I guess main menu or whatever. Yeah, startup menu. That's what you call it. And you are going to hit F9, the boot options. Hold on a second. F9, you're going to hit on the keyboard. Once you get there, um, it's going to just ask you where do you want to boot to. So you're going to choose your hard, your hard drive, your notebook hard drive. All right. Now, if you try to reinstall Windows or try to do a system restore, it's not going to work. Trust me, it's not going to work. So, the only workaround is to do what I just said. Alright, so anyway, you're going to hit enter. And then now it's going to allow you to, to boot up into Windows. It's going to ask you... Um, this only comes up if you have uh, um, uh, I forgot the name of the program, but I'll, I'll have to show you later. But anyway, let's go to Windows 7. Oops, I didn't press Enter. Okay. All right, just start normally. Let's wait for it to come up. Um. So hold on. <sighs> Trying to do this as quickly as possible because I just bought some Chinese food and I'm hungry. Alright. As you can see, I am able to, well, let's let it load first. Ah, sorry for the shakiness. All right. Just please wait. Come on, come on, come on. Also apologize for the noise in the background. That's the fan. 
my AC broke, so I'm currently using the fan right now. All right, so now that, that it, now that it loaded up, I'm gonna log in. In a few minutes, you might see an edit. Just gonna let it load up, and once it once it loads up, guys, then you'll be able to you know access. You'll be able be able to access all your files, basically. But um, at the same time, it's gonna be really slow. It's gonna be like it's gonna start freezing up. I mean, that's that's the only problem. But um, this is the workaround. So if you have that same exact error that you saw in the beginning, here you go. This is actually the error that I get when um. And it tells you right there, Windows detected a hard disk problem. Back up your files immediately to prevent lost information. Now, I don't back it up the, the way that they tell you to back it up on here. I use this other program called Acronis. I will put it in the link. Um, I'm trying to hurry up. I'm trying to actually hurry up with this video. But um, I will put the, 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 um, the video showing you. Um, ah, I'll put the video in the link. Um, Acronis, I mean not the video, the the software. Acronis is one of the best backing up softwares to use, and basically it just it makes an image of your hard drive, and that's that's what I'm using right now. But um, but as of right now, I have to get a new hard drive. Once I once I've done that, then I'll use one of my good images that I saved on my on my um, external and. And then I'll be good from there. But as of right now, the hard drive that I have is it's, it's dying, as you can see, and it's time that I replace it. So if you if you get to this, good. That means you can uh, get you can get some of your files right now, some of your files that are that are on your computer. Like I said, it's gonna take a long time to load up, depending on how fast your computer is. But you you could uh, you could access some of your files. Or any pictures that you have saved on there. So um, that's about it, guys. Um, I hope this video helped. Uh, if you have any questions or anything, just let me know. All right, all right. Um, I'm about to eat some Chinese food right now, guys. Peace.